My name is Kitan Petkovsky. I'm a theatre director and the assistant director on My Sister Jill. I have always been obsessed with theatre making and drama since I was uh, probably a teenager when everyone else was playing outside rugby or tennis. I was in my drama room class reenacting music videos. My first job was as a, a youth actor and uh, we created a devised physical theatre piece that examined the lives of eight young men um, growing up and all the vulnerable moments that we go through um, as teenagers. And it was a great training ground for me to um, really understand how theatre works. The roles of theatre making, the role of a director, actor, stage manager, I didn't even know what a stage manager was at the time. And I discovered acting was, was so much fun, but I, I really wanted to look at the bigger picture and I wanted to work behind the scenes. So I slowly steered my way towards directing. Ended up training at VCA, doing a, a two-year master's course. and. Um, a few years later, here I am. And something I'm really passionate about is telling stories that give voice to uh, minority groups. As a queer immigrant in Australia, I really advocate for representation and uh, sharing stories from different perspectives. I'm so excited to assist and direct my sister Jill and work alongside two legendary theatre makers, Susie D and Patricia Cornelius, on a new Australian play. It feels like the dream job and I find myself almost skipping to rehearsal every morning with happy vibes and excitement. And just, I said to my partner the other day, I love my job and how often do you get to say that? Susie has such wealth of knowledge um, and experience and something that I've learned over the last couple of weeks is how to step back and look at the bigger picture and always consider how production elements such as lighting, sound, moving set pieces can help tell a story. Something I'm really enjoying about uh, working with Susie at the moment is all the games we play in the room. We do warm ups together as a group and there is always this playful energy before we get started on a maybe like a really serious or a heavy scene but we always start the day with a fun game it just brings us together i'm really gonna try and steal that little playful energy from susie and probably start to incorporate it in my own room making theater at a state level theatre company is quite different from indie theatre and I think um, a lot of artists can share this notion with me. I remember on the first day we um, of rehearsals we all arrived here and there were about 50 or 60 Melbourne Theatre Company staff that came and joined us from, for the welcome and they all introduced themselves and shared their role and I just realised oh my god there are so many people working on this one production and um, helping us realise this massive Australian play and it was just really exciting I've never seen so many people in one room working on a single project. When I first read My Sister Jill, I was deeply moved and I felt like I wanted to give every character a big hug. It just reminded me of how much families go through together and they really share those experiences outside of the family home. Patricia has this innate ability to write for actors and with actors in mind and how they're able to breathe life in her text. I think audiences will be taken on a comedic and emotional roller coaster. This is a story about a really tight family unit. It includes a lot of funny memories, a lot of devastating memories, and I would say a lot of memories that people like me would be so embarrassed to talk about or mention beyond my own families. Career advice I'd give to aspiring directors and theatre makers is to keep making your own work um, and to always learn from your past experiences. I always learn and I always want to do something better. I always want to challenge myself with the next project. Go and see as much as you can. I think some of the best education in theatre is to see, to see shows that you wouldn't usually watch, to, um, to discuss a production with your mates. What did you like about it? What didn't you like? And most importantly, why?